Hello, my name is Amy Ecker and welcome to my channel. So today is day two using the Lorac Mega Pro number no. four palette. And you know, when I used it yesterday, I went with a really dark eye, kind of fun. And I had used some of the browns and then kind of did a halo with that fairy tale color. And then I took the peacock underneath. So I thought, okay. Well, yesterday I did a really, really kind of dark in-your-face eye. So why not do the exact opposite with the Lorac palette today? And I had kind of eyed, you know, my eye kept going to these soft colors here. And so that's where today's look comes from. So I used basically four colors. I used the Flamingo, Cotton, Unicorn, and Lotus. All really light colors. And then I... I took a NYX Vivid Brights eyeliner to do the eyeliner just to give it a pop of color, something a little bit different than the typical browns or blacks to uh, do the little wing. And basically the whole face is just a lighter look. And I just wanted to do kind of a yin and yang with this palette to show that you can do the really dark eye looks, which I typically like or you could do something softer. And even though I did it soft, I still added kind of a bold eyeliner to make it a little bit more fun because I just can't get too soft. You know, I just can't get too soft. But all the colors that I have on today are really light. They, they work well together. And then that pop of the Vivid Bright for the eyeliner just kind of perks up the look so that it doesn't get lost especially on my skin since my skin is so light sometimes using a lot of light colors really just it just washes it just disappears so to be able to use a bold eyeliner in purple kind of picked up the look because otherwise again with my fair skin and a lot of light colors it just looks like I'm sick mm -hmm. it does if I went to work with just no pop of a bright color on my eyes um, I would n inevitably be asked are you not feeling well today you look different are you not feeling well yeah that's what I get when I don't wear a lot of makeup or I wear too much uh, light colors I did not do do a any false lashes today yesterday I did some magnetic false ones today I just used my own eyelashes so again kind of toning down the look but still having a pop of color and this look actually went really really fast i guess because i don't i didn't use a whole lot of colors i don't know i don't know that's probably it and i i kept underneath the eye um underneath the eye really clear or clean i didn't add any anything under there just to keep it kind of nice, fresh, and kind of a toned down look. I guess I'm just really freaked out that I did a toned down look is what it comes down to. But we must push ourselves out of our beauty comfort zone, right? <laughs> so anyways, if you want to see how I put this look together using the Little Rock Mega Pro 4, stay tuned. Um, I did use the, which you won't see it in the video, but I use the Tardius Pro Glow palette for my contour. Tarte Shape Tape was for my concealer. And then for my lips, I used a combo. I used the NYX Liquid Suede Cream Lipstick. And this is an LSCL04. And for a little bit of some fun on the inner part of the lip I used some melted matte metallic this one is in pillow talk from Too Faced let's see my I guess that's really the main bits oh and then for the the blush I did use the Lorac Los Angeles palette and I picked up this color Ray the highlighter I used here was called Sunlight. 
So as far as the the main piece of the face, y'all know what that is, except my foundation. And my foundation is the Becca Ultimate Coverage. I'm having a lot of fun with this one lately. I just like how it sits on the face. I don't like how it comes off on my phone, but that's a subject for another day, right? All right, so now you guys are all caught up ready to see how I play with these colors to get this kind of uh, softer with a punch of color I look for today. And I want to say thank you to Sabrina the Makeup Mom who sent me this palette. Um, I really, really appreciate it. Love the eyeliner she sent. Of course, I loved everything else in the box she sent, but the eyeliner and the Mega Pro 4 has, were the highlights of the box you sent. So anyways, I just keep rambling. I just keep rambling. But do want to say a very special thanks to Sabrina the Makeup Mom for sending those to me. So anyways, y'all have a great day. day and here we go using Lorac Mega Pro. And I did use the Lorac Los Angeles palette for my cheeks. Just in case you wanted to know. Okay, today we're going to start out with Flamingo. I think we're going to take Unicorn. And unicorn is coming out a little bit lighter than I had thought it would. We're going to pick up some Lotus. I'm going to grab some cotton. We're just underneath the brow bone. We're just underneath the eyebrows. I'm going to pick up the NYX Vivid Bright and Vivid Violet. Going in with the new Double Decker from Butter London. It's my fave right now. I think this is my third tube I've gone through. Thank you so much for watching this video using the Lorac Palette Mega Pro 4 Day 2. So yesterday, you know, I had done a really smoky kind of darker eye. Maybe not smoky, just a lot of the darker colors. Really loved it. So today, I wanted to do the exact opposite. And so I had fun using this palette again. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing or refer me to a friend. And as always, you have a choice, so make it a great one. Until next time.